What is happening? What is going on? You absolute bunch of legends. So what I'm going to do in this video is I'm going to show you how to make a glow effect with Blender with like a glow material and you can then create like pretty cool looking things. You can use it for just a normal material or what you could do is you could like make your make the uh, this material your lighting for your scene. So you could like use that as lighting instead of like an area light. You could use this material or these this method. So the first thing we need to do is we need to add an object. So I'm going to use a normal cube. So I'm going to go shift A mesh and I'm going to go to cube and I'm going to add it like that. And then I'm just going to go to X and G and I'm going to bring it up to the ground level like that. Then what you want to do is go to compositing, boom, and check use nodes, boom. And then what you want to do is go shift A and get a layer node. So search, just type in layer so g l a r e and plug it in between the rendered layers and the composite node and now if you want to see your object while you're working just go back to layout click here and go to compositor and drag this up and zoom in to here like that and then go here so we've got this i'm going to delete the camera and i'm going to just click there and i'm going to uncheck and then click here and select always. Then what you want to do is go to shading. So click there and let's go here as well. Select object, hit new. Then what you want to do is go down here to emission, change the string. So let's bring it up to like five and it gives you something like this now. And if you go to EV, you'll see you've got something like this now and select always. Boom. And now what you want to do is go back to compositing. Just change this to fog glow. And it looks a bit better like that now. So if I go to shading, this gives it a nice kind of glowing effect. You can obviously change the color. You can change it to like a blue. You can change it like that or you can any color you want. And then you can go back to compositing and you can change this. You can even make it bloom, which will also look quite nice. Gives you something like this now. And I'm getting what, what will look even better is if I click on the world and make it completely dark. You got something like this now, and it goes pretty nicely like that. So you can see there. And then you can adjust the strength in your shading. So you can click here, changes to like three, and it decreases the strength, obviously. And this does work in cycles. So if I click here and I go to cycles, you can see now you got something like this, and it's nice and blooming, and it looks pretty good. Fog glow, you can see streaks don't look as nice. Fog glow doesn't look as nice, but bloom in Eevee and cycles both look pretty good. It's probably the best glow, in my opinion, to use for, yeah, for if you want something to like glow in Blender. And it's really that easy to make it glow, bloom in Blender. So, yeah, hopefully you enjoyed this quick video. Make sure you hit the subscribe button if you haven't already. I would appreciate that. And share the video with your grandmother then she'll learn Blender like us. See you in the next video. Peace.